ladies and gentlemen, this is fight or get knocked out. Cause you gon' fight the fight or you gon' get knocked out. The show goes on. This is my home. They're gonna need a fucking wrecking ball to take me out of here. <laughs> They're gonna need to send in the National Guard a fucking SWAT team. Cause I ain't going nowhere. Tiafimo Lopez. I question myself for a good reason. I've always been my worst critic. And you guys got a little glimpse of it, but I just gotta ask you one thing and one thing only. Do I still got it? Versus Jermaine Ortiz. I, I definitely try to be an entertaining fighter. You know, um, there's some things you gotta be, you gotta either be entertaining outside the ring or inside the ring. You, you, can't, you can't be boring inside and out. <laughs> you yeah. know what I'm saying? Yo, you can't be born right. inside and out. You gotta pick one. <laughs> right. You gotta pick one. A 140 pound showdown, the first title defense of the young champion known as the Takeover. Let's make history, baby. It's the beginning, baby. This is the beginning, baby. Line these dudes up one after another. The taker is claiming it's over for each individual soul, staring in the eyes of the fleshlings, asking questions like this. You feel this. Do you feel like dark abyss? All your deeds laid bare. All your sins punished. The WBO Lenio Jr. welterweight champ is making it clear, saying he's the index finger that knocked over the dominoes posing as fighters. Volcanic eruptions, I'm nature, this chamber has lava that's molten within. The serpent is coiled in Pisces is no more, my nigga just check on my fin. The crisis of energy wielded with power like fuck it, my nigga, I'm him. You scary, I write in the scripture, I'm sorry, my nigga, but fear is a sin. The chronicles of a nigga's life on the walls located in him. The blackness of ice is reflected in empties on February 8th. The technician is screaming, hell no, I'm not going out like that, Claude. My daddy died in a place like this because of that shit you talking. He gave up hope and hung himself. And I ain't going out like that, Claude. Well, maybe you fooling yourself, right? Maybe you just a chip off the old block. 2015, Tio defeated Ortiz in a amateur bout, a match that Jermaine will never forget. To me, it was a competitive fight. Uh, I didn't have my coach with me at the time. Uh, he had to fly out literally the day before. It was the finals of the National Golden Gloves. But this time, um, ready with my team fully equipped with ammo and ready to start shooting on February 8th. The two will clash in Viva Las Vegas. Viva Las Vegas. Viva Las Vegas. Teofimo Lopez, talk to the people about your up and coming extravaganza of event come February 8th. I told y'all though, don't call this a comeback. This is the takeover takeover. They all man-made. Teofimo is self-made. They can never make another one. The champion is talking from his perspective. Jermaine Ortiz, you hear the competition talking greasy, but the story has two sides. Speak duality. Help the people understand. Poke your chest out, Mr. Technician. From the beginning, I've, I've, I've said it many times, you know, I'm not converting into what the new sport tends to glamour off of just the fame and the money uh that will come but at the same time i still got that old school work ethic and that old school mindset of i still want to become world champion i want to create history for my state and my city and i still want goals to achieve in the sport of boxing so when i'm gone it's not just i'm here and i got paid but i actually did something in the sport as well the eighth day of the second month in the state of surveillance, two egos will clash. Will it be a chess match or rock'em sock'em robots? Saul, are you ready? Yes. Are you ready? I'm ready. Fight! Three, two, 
Real technique here. Clash of styles. The two young men willingly sacrificed their life force, put in fight or get knocked out in the position to call a blow by blow like no other. In left round number nine and twelve. Right hand, right to him. Oh, he's hurt. He's hurt. Right hand, he's hurt. He's out on his feet. He's out on his feet. Tony Harrison is out. He take a knee, nigga. Take a knee, nigga. Take it out. Oh, shit. He bobbled him. Tony Harrison is hurt. Tony Harrison is hurt. Get your shit together, baby. Take a knee, nigga. One hand. Uppercut. 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 Get an uppercut. Uppercut. Right hand is over. Stop. Right hand. He's down. Right hand. He's down. Tony Harrison is down. Tim Zoo is tearing his ass up on the roof. Oh, shit. Oh, he ain't gonna get up. It's a wrap. It's over. It's a wrap. It's over. It's a wrap. Wait, he up. There you go, nigga. Get up. Get your get back. He's wobbled. He's wobbled. Um, this time oh, he caught the fight. It's over. It's a wrap. Tim Zoo. ESPN is the destination, and I can't forget the plush. I show up and show out, and oh, baby, Mark Chinook. Get us ready for the bout. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome inside the MGM Grand here in beautiful Las Vegas, Nevada. This is fighter get knocked out. Protect yourself at all times. What I say, you must obey. And I'm O-U-T. And I'm at. Cause we've been through some